Now we're staying in uh, Haifa, but to a heartbreaking story that uh, raises a lot of the questions of ethics and our rights. An Israeli teenager suffering from leukemia fled uh, chemotherapy treatment last week in Haifa's Rambam Hospital, posting a video begging for the right to die with dignity. As of uh, this evening, he's agreed to return to treatment, but it didn't come easily. I'm אני מבקש מכל מי שיכול לבוא להפגין כאן בכניסה לבית החולים רמב״ם בחיפה לגבי הטיפול בכפייה שרוצים לעשות לי. גם אם אני צריך למות, תנו לי למות בכבוד, זה כל הבקשה שלי. It was from his hospital bed that this 16-year-old teen called on Israeli citizens to come protest against chemotherapy that doctors would like to impose on him. These treatments won't help me. They will only aggravate my situation. There's only prayer that can help me. I prefer to stay at home than to be at the hospital. The young man is from an Orthodox family in the northern city of Tiberias. A few days ago, he fled his hospital room. After being alerted by Haifa's Rambam Hospital, the court ordered his parents to bring him back. According to doctors there, without treatment, his chances of survival are slim. At the hospital, I'm locked up and I feel alone. I'm not well. I want them to leave me alone. A distressed appeal from this teen, who has suffered from leukemia since he was 11. After several treatments and two remissions, the cancer came back around a year ago. A rare form of the disease that demands new chemotherapy, but this time he refuses to do it. His parents are supporting his decision, though they had no choice but to bring him back into hospital care. His parents hope he will continue the treatment. What parents would not want their child to be in good health? That being said, this is a very mature teen, with his own will, his own opinions, and we think that treating his cancer by force, attached to his hospital bed, will not bring him any good. For its part, the hospital responded, and for them, it's not a question of forcing a patient to continue treatment. The boy is hospitalized according to the court order. He refused treatment, so he remains in his room. The doctors do not intend to treat him by force, and the reason is simple. The treatment required for a possible cure is long and requires patient cooperation, and his total commitment to respect even the smallest protocol. Without cooperation, no treatment will be effective. But this patient has one wish, to leave his hospital room and go home to Tiberias and make the most of every minute.